So today we are describing tubal cannulation for blocked uh, tubes. For blocked filament tubes or uterine tubes, this is the right ostia. We have done the tubal cannulation. So Mr. Miraj will withdraw the guide wire. So this much length of guide wire has been threaded in the left filament tube. Now we will try to uh, remove the block in the left tube. We will try to remove the block in the left tube. So guide wire out. Yes. So we will try to cannulate the left tube as well, Mr. Miraj. We will try to cannulate the left tube as well. So let us go close by. The bubble is giving us some tension here. So easily it has passed. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. So the guide wire has been threaded. So Mr. Miraj will withdraw the guide wire. Yes, this much length of guide wire has been threaded in the left tube. Not, now let us check the bubble test in both tubes. Now let us check the bubble test in both tubes. Give me syringe. Now let us check bubble test the left tube as well as the, the right tube. The bubble is going in. The bubbles are going in the right tube. Easily we can see the bubbles are going. Yes. The bubbles are going. Yes. Left tube bubbles are not going that easily. The right tube. Uh, yes, the right tube bubbles are going with these. So at least one tube has been opened. In this case, we can clearly see left tube. The bubbles are yes, going in. So we have restored the tubal potency with the help of method known as osteal cannulation. There are features of chronic endometritis as well. We are sending you greetings from Harkar Center, Srinagar, Kashmir, JNT, India. God bless us all.